सो आर टॉपिक इज शेप ऑफ आर बाइटल्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल एस सप्शल एज वी ऑल नो इट इज हैविंग ओनली वन आर बाइटल वन आर बाइटल सो द आर बाइटल प्रेजेंट एस सप्शल द शेप ऑफ दैट आर बाइटल एस आर बाइटल हैविंग spherical symmetric shape and the finding and the probability of finding and the probability of finding is in all directions in also as our vital we are having spherical shape symmetric spherical shape and the probability of electron in it's in all direction like in as i told that in orbitals the probability of finding electron the probability of finding electron is maximum so the uh, orbital present as subshell that the was in the probability of finding electron will be in all direction how in all direction like here this is x axis so y axis and this is a x axis so the this is having spherical shape because in s uh, subshell we are having only one orbital and so it will be in all directions same in all directions so the probability of finding electron will be in all directions so this is a shape of s orbital this is a spherical shape that will be in all directions there is another point that is the size of s orbital will increase with the increase of with the increase of n now what is n n is a principal quantum number n is a principal quantum number so in s orbital the increase of size will be the increase of n how the increase of size will be dependent upon the quantum number like this here we are having for example 1s square what is 1 1 is a coefficient of sub of shells like it represent the in which shell it is so it's one so it will be in shell one which is k so s is a orbital and two is a electron two is showing electron like in this one s square is coefficient of shell in this point saying that if this is the coefficient of which is n this is the principal quantum number number of shells n is representing of number of shells like if it will be like this so the 2 2 is showing the number of shells so in this point saying that the increase of n will be the increase of s orbital shape like it is for example it is 1 s square if we will writing 2 s square the shape will be more bigger than that so the number of n will be increasing so the shape of spherical will also be increasing so that was the point and the point we are having that is in s orbital in the spherical shape spherical shape is because of is because of more nuclear force more nuclear force than the 
रिपल जी फोर्स एज आई टोल दैट इन एस और बाइटल वी आर हैविंग ऑनली इन वन और बाइटल एज वी नो इन वन और बाइटल वी आर हैविंग टू इलेक्ट्रॉन्स एंड इन एस शेल वी आर हैविंग ऑनली वन और बाइटल सो इन के शेल देयर विल बी टू इलेक्ट्रॉन्स ओनली सो देयर विल बी रिपल जी फोर्स सॉरी देर विल बी रिपल जी फोर्स लेस देन द न्यूक्लियर फोर्स हाउ लाइक दिस लाइक इट इज ओनली हैविंग टू इलेक्ट्रॉन बिकॉज एस इज हैविंग ओनली वन ऑर्बिटल एंड वन ऑर्बिटल इज हैविंग टू इलेक्ट्रॉन्स सो वन विल मूव इन क्लॉक वाइज एंड अनदर विल मूव इन एंटी क्लॉक वाइज सो दिस विल मूव इन क्लॉक वाइज एंड दिस विल मूव इन एंटी क्लॉक वाइज सो देर विल बी नो रिपल जी फोर्स सो देर विल बी मोर न्यूक्लियर फोर्स दैन द रिपल जी फोर्स सो दैट्स वाई इट्स हैविंग इज फेरिकल शेप बिकॉज न्यूक्लियर फोर्स इज मोर देन द रिपल जी फोर्स बिकॉज इट्स हैविंग ऑनली टू इलेक्ट्रॉन्स ना एन अदर वी हैविंग दैट इज दैट इज पी और बेटल the p orbital it is having it is having dumbbell shape like this this is like dumbbell shape so the in p orbitals there there is a dumbbell shape in this as we know in p or in p sub shell we are having three orbitals Or vitals, like if you find here two l plus one for finding the orbitals, two l is representing azimuthal quantum number of p that is one plus one two plus two into one is two plus one that is three. So they are having three orbitals in p sub p sub shell. So these three orbitals of p. the three orbitals of p having same energy same energy same size and shape the three orbitals of p having same energy same size and same shape the the I'm sorry the orbitals which are of same subshell and having same energy that are called degenerate orbitals that called degenerate orbitals the orbitals which are having same energy or they are of same subshell that called the degenerate orbitals like this is a p orbitals so in p orbital we are having three orbitals which are of same energy too so these three orbitals we we'll call the degenerate orbitals the orbitals of p the orbitals of p called degenerate orbitals because these three are having same energy the same energy of same subshell orbitals called the degenerate orbitals okay so another point is that is the the lobes lie along 
in the three axis. Like it is having three orbitals, so it will be located in three axis that is x, y, and z axis, py, px, and pz axis. They will look at it like this. Now I will be making shapes here of three of these. First of all, we are having py. This is y axis. This is x axis. Now, first of all, py. Py will be like this. Sorry. PY will be like this. This is PY. Another area I'm having PY. Now PX. You have a Y axis. X axis. Now PX. And that will be like this is px this was a py this is px now i'm going to having that is pz this is y axis this is x axis and here that is z axis z axis is like this now sorry this is z axis how will be PZ? PZ. PZ will be like this. PZ. This is PZ. That was PX and PY. These were the shape of P orbital that are dumbbell shapes. You can see here these are looking like dumbbell. So it is having dumbbell shape. Another is that is. Uh, D uh, orbitals, D orbitals. Now, what is the shape of D orbitals? That is double dumbbell shape. Double dumbbell shape. So, as we all know, in D orbitals, we are having, in D subshell, we are having how many orbitals? Here we will find. Here, two. The azimuth number of D is 2 plus 1, 2 to the 4 plus 1. It is having 5 orbitals. 5 orbitals. So D orbitals having 5 orbitals. Now 5 orbitals are designed as DXY, DXZ, D yz dx square minus y square and dz square these are the uh, uh, orbitals of d as i written with the axis now why uh, d orbital having double dumbbell shape because because of high energy because of high energy and spinning area increase spinning area increase how spinning area increase because as I told that in D we are having 5 orbitals so there will be high increasing area so because of that we are having double dumbbell shape now here we will make how we are having double double shape but before that the point from that is the shapes of first four orbitals first four orbitals are seen but the shape of the shape of fifth one orbital is different like 
the starting five orbitals having double dumbbell shape and this fifth one having donut shape here we will see how these are having donut shape first of all number one that was dxy here dxy y x this is x and this is y so it will be made dxy this is of x and this is of y so dxy this you can see in p where we are having only one this that will be called dum dumbbell shape so in this we are having double dumbbell shape now dyz How you having shape of D Y Z? Here, and this is X axis. Oh, sorry, Z axis. Wait a minute. This will be Z axis. And this will be y axis. So this will be make dyz. Now dxz. How the shape of dxz? This is z and this is x. dxz. As you can see, these three having double 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 shape. Now dx square and y square d x square and y square x y this will be of square dx square and dy square dx square and dy square will be on the axis you can see this is on the axis and these are not on the axis these are between the axis but these dx square and dy square is on the axis therefore d square and y square now we have it. that will be dz square as i told it is having dub donor shape how z x y it will be it will be also on the axis it will be like this because it's x square d x square so this is the shape of dz square you can see here donut so it is called that's why dz square is a donut shape and this now another point i will write here dxy dyz and dx set now here dx square minus y square and dz set square this c will be between the axis and these two will be on the axis as you can see this is bit on the axis but these three were in between the axis so these were the shape of as an orbital s orbital having spherical shape and p having double dumbbell shape and d are having double dumbbell shape